epic Minecraft trap. Hey guys, I have a really cool guy here. <clears throat> Sorry, I have a cold. But practically, today I'm going to show you my silverfish trap. Okay, right now I am a griefer looking for treasures. Huh. My treasure keep out. Well, he warned me, but I'm still going to go for it. Okay, it looks legit. Two silverfish and a poison potion. Oh god, there's more, there's more. Here, I'll, I'll fight them off though. Eh, no. Okay, so as you can see, I'm getting pummeled by these silverfish. And there's a lot of XP over there. And I mean, like, a lot. So, oh god, oh god, no. And I just don't know. Okay, well, let's see how it works. The redstone. As you can see, <clears throat> this says my treasure keep out to make people want to go in. If you say free cake or something good like that, it's too obvious. So then they walk in and they step on this tripwire. As you can see, it's hidden in the walls. So that, and it's right on the ground so that no one can see it. When the tripwire activates, <coughs> it, it will slowly hit this dispenser, which will shoot out a poison potion. It has to be slower than the other dispensers, because otherwise the poison potion would shoot before the silverfish come out. And by the way, it has to be splash potions. Warning. Okay, <clears throat> and now, on this one, it's a redstone trail to both of those dispensers. And as you can see, it's actually supposed to go to both of them, not just one. <laughs> okay, as you can see, you just want the same thing. And you can delete that block if you want. But those both lead to dispensers that are filmed with silverfish eggs. Whenever you step on the pressure plate, it will shoot out silverfish eggs, and soon after, it will shoot the poison potion to poison those silverfish. Poison silverfish will call their friends. To do that, they, uh, they, every time they take a half a heart of damage from poison, they will call one of their friends out of stone brick monster eggs. As you can see, they look the same, but are different. Keep in mind that the house is made of stone brick monster eggs. And as you can see, if you break it, an easy, medium, or easy, normal, or hard, then a silverfish will come out. If a silverfish takes damage from poison, then the Stonebrook monster eggs will automatically break, spawning more, uh, spawning more silverfish. Someone might ask, why did I spit out two silverfish instead of just keeping two silverfish in the house at, at the time? The problem is, th is that when you get to a certain distance away from the silverfish, they would despawn. So it's really important that you set your trap to spit out the poison and a couple of silverfish. But make sure that you do the silverfish first, because otherwise you'll spit the poison out. Okay, thanks for watching. Epically Cool Guy, signing off.